What's going on guys? Today is Saturday, November 11th. It's in the afternoon now. I was working this morning. I was actually doing some trucking. Uh, with my job, I haul ice from a manufacturing facility to distribution facilities. And something kind of cool about the ice company I work for, we actually provide the ice to Newark Airport. So if, you, if by chance you happen to be catching a flight out of Newark and you know they include those com complimentary sodas and like a little cup of ice, there's a good chance I probably hauled that down there. So. Something kind of interesting, but anyway, I got a project that I'm working on today. I picked up a bunch of hay, and it doesn't really have a proper tarp system. And I'd also like to find a place to cover up this mower for the winter. So, I'm not sure if you guys have ever seen the way I keep my wood covered. Uh, I'll, I'll go over this again real quick. I think I did a video about it in the past. So, there's a tripod right here. There's a stick that goes across to another tripod on the other side of this tarp. And that acts as kind of like the, the top post. And then I put a lot of tension on the tarp on the sides. So the rainwater comes right off. And nothing really rubs and it's, it's really self-sufficient. So I'd like to make another tarp system like this. Probably somewhere over there so I can store this hay and lawnmower kind of in the woods so it's not driveway so that's what I'm working on let's get started I think I got a helper for today come to help me as much as I'd like to do a tarp canopy for the hay and that right on tractor I don't think that's really practical or necessary so what my revised plan of action is, I'm going to move this stuff out of the way. I'm going to get the tractor, lay down two pallets so the hay is somewhat off the ground, and then we're just going to cover it, and that should be all right for the winter. That's 60 bales.
nature calls. Much better. I think getting up early in conjunction with all the Halloween candy I've been eating has been kind of messing up my system. We're all good though. I remember this day I wasn't really feeling that great and at that point in time I really just wanted to finish up this job as quick as possible. Unfortunately though the battery on this tractor is completely dead so the following clip is me just trying to jump start this thing and move it as quick as possible. It's not pretty, it's not elaborate, it's not creative, but it should do the job. Just something to keep the hay covered and keep the tractor covered for winter. Uh, one of the common issues with uh, snow and tarps is snow likes to pile on the tarp and really dig into whatever is underneath it. So in an effort to counter that, I made this stack pretty high to try and increase the angle. So hopefully the snow will kind of just roll off the tarp and also to aid the snow rolling off I took these one by six pieces of cedar I believe this is cedar that I uh, salvaged off some old pallets kind of left it on an angle so that way when the snow builds up here it will have that pallet or excuse me that piece of one by six to eventually kind of put pressure on so hopefully that'll prevent that from happening and the tarps just anchored down with a couple of rounds of wood that hasn't been split yet I really got to get going on that pile. It's just so hard on your body, splitting all this wood by hand. I've considered investing in a log splitter for some years now, but they're pretty expensive and I feel like most of the time it just sit around. You know, one of these days I might just have to go down to Home Depot and rent a splitter, which I think they're like 75 bucks a day, so. Yep, it's probably gonna come down to that because if, if I just let these rounds of wood sit here for another year they're gonna get wet further than they've already gotten they're gonna start rotting and then i'm gonna lose the wood so it's probably just worth going down to home depot and renting a splitter so i really feel like crap i don't know if it's because i've been working too hard or or just this cold setting in so fast it's probably a combination of both i really gotta take a day off and i'm trying to film for youtube too <laughs> it's a lot so Appreciate you guys watching, appreciate a thumbs up and subscribe, really appreciate it, encourages me to do more videos. So until next time, bye.